Hello everyone, I'm Max and in this video I'm cleaning up my dad's old notebook Sony Vio from 2010. This features AMD 350E processor with whopping 2 cores on the base speed at 1.6 GHz. It also has the AMD graphics and 4 GB of RAM. As you see the specs are pretty poor but we will try to clean this thing up and then we will try to install the Windows 10 to see if it's even capable of running it. So let's remove the battery and just get rid of the plastic chassis on the back to get the access to the components. We just need to remove the screws from the bottom. Now we have the access to the HDD drive and the RAM slot. At this point I can upgrade the components but unfortunately I don't have the new parts with me so I'm not able to get this thing removed and upgrade it. So we're gonna leave it as it is now. Now let me just get rid of the additional couple of screws on the back of this chassis and then we'll just try to clean up the fan of this laptop. Unfortunately to get to the fan at this point I will need to remove the keyboard, HDD drive and so many other things so it's not even worth the hassle. With that said let me just get rid of the dust on the components and then it should perform just a bit better. Now once we clean out the things we wanted to, let's just put it back together. First we go over the screws and then the battery needs to be placed in. Now let me also clean up the display, keyboard and the whole cover. So as you can see, it's made out of the plastic, so it won't be that hard to clean this thing up. Once we clean it all up, let's begin installing the newest version of Windows 10. Likely Microsoft nowadays makes it so simple for users to get the newest version of their operating system. It's all free if you have the original copy of the previous generation of this software. First you wanna go to the original page, download the utility and then the Windows 10 itself. It's so simple, takes a couple of minutes to get it done and then you're able to install the brand new Windows 10 on your device. Soon after that we boot up with the latest Windows 10. Unfortunately, the 2 core 11 years old CPU is not that capable of running latest OS so smoothly, but it's somewhat usable compared to the Windows 7. It offers way more features and it looks way more modern. Soon after the installation, I also removed some unwanted programs, reduced the animation, and the laptop was running it even more flawlessly. So that's it, guys. The 11 years old Sony Vio notebook running the latest. Windows 10. Keep in mind that if I upgrade this laptop from 4GB to 8 and added the SSD drive instead of the current HDD, the experience of using the laptop will be much better. Unfortunately, the 2 core CPU on this thing limits the capabilities of the laptop significantly. Thank you guys for watching. Leave the likes if you like it, dislikes if you don't, and see me in the next video. See you guys.